What was your favorite thing to do in school? For me, it was arts and crafts. Who doesn't love being creative? Well, the folks at the City of Santa Monica are looking to put those creative skills back in action as they give a Santa Monica landmark a fun new vibe. Greg Goldner has more. You've probably driven by this building hundreds of times, camera obscure, but right next door is 1450 Ocean, which has always kind of been a senior rec center. Now they're offering new workshops and classes for all kinds of arts and crafts and culture for folks of all ages. Let's check it out. This is our big launch for what we're trying to do with the center, which is really add some new programs uh, for adults. Uh, that are all about hands-on crafts and art. This is a project called Crafternoon. It's our roving craft table for adults. Everything is um, recycled or repurposed from previous projects that I've worked on. So um, I just have this collection of things that I don't want to throw away, and I just keep recycling and reusing them and refabulizing them into party streamers today. Uh, we also made these. Um, we'll be making these today, and these are these were from candy boxes. This is what went around the candy box. So I just made um, a streamer out of it because um, it'll look great at a dinner party or bar mitzvah. Thanks to some not so encouraging words from my arts and crafts teachers when I was younger, I figured out pretty early on that arts and crafts weren't really my thing. However, I wasn't going to pass up the chance to use one of these nearly 100 year old sewing machines. Can I ask you a question? Is it weird that my shoulder's getting a little tired? <laughs> <laughs> not really. <laughs> my, my arm's getting a little sore. And it's not just about coming to 1450 Ocean and crafting things. It's about learning the culture behind it. You might be taking a dance class, but that dance class might be based on learning about another culture, whether it's samba or rumba or whatever. It's less about a place where you can come and hear a concert or see a show and more a place where you can make something yourself. So you can kind of reconnect to your own creativity and your own artistry. Whether it's making a party streamer or knitting something fun, or even finding out that maybe, just maybe, you do have some crafting ability, 1450 Ocean has something for everyone. For Santa Monica Update, I'm Greg Goldner. Impressive. I didn't know Greg could sew. How awesome are those sewing machines? Nearly 100 years old. For more information and to check out what classes are being offered, head over to facebook.com slash 1450ocean. Whether it's sewing, decorating, or whatever your creative fancy, 1450ocean has something for everyone.